Ladies and gentlemen, it is time to earn the fruits of our labor. It is time to see if we got for the first time rewards for competing in Sorea. For me, actually, it is the first time now that I will go to the platform and see if I won something in the last game week that I participated. So really a debut here for me as a Sora manager. And if you also want to get going on Sora as a manager, uh, start investing, start collecting and start earning rewards with your virtual sports cards, I can give you a little help with the affiliate link down in my description. If you click on that and then immediately open an account, you will actually get a free card from Sora as a bonus once you collected your first five cards on the new card auction market on Sora. Plus, I will personally give you my free Sora success checklist, a checklist that I put together basically with all the necessary steps that you need to take in order to set you up for maximum success on Sora. All right, and now let's get going here on Sora and see if I actually won something. So as you see here, once I look uh, into the platform, I already have a red mark here uh, with the notification bell and also this little gift here um, is wobbling around so let's see what this means as a quick reminder this is now for the game week 215 where i participated and it already says completed i participated with the same team that i signed up now for the current game week which is alison in the goal bruno martins india as a central back birga festrete and sondra trenstad as a midfielder and then we have joe mario as a forward so now let's get to it and see if i won some rewards as a quick reminder here as well for this tournament that i competed in it is the uh, rare competition the all-star league and here i would need let's see um 250 points in order to get 0 0.02 ethereum or over 205 points in order to get 0 0.01 ethereum or if i'm lucky and land above the top performing players i could even earn um, a higher share of ethereum here plus um, a star rare card who could actually be someone like Erling Haaland, Lionel Messi, Josh Kimmich or even Kylian Mbappé. So let's see, let's just get right to it. I'm pretty excited, hope you too. Uh, first, let's check out this notification bell here. Okay, it's Welcome America Fuji World Club. Okay, that's not, re not relevant for us right now. So we click on this little gift icon here and see we got a new reward three days ago. First time I'm looking it up now with you together. <laughs> so let's click on it. Claim your rewards. Woo! And we got 0 0.02 Ethereum. Amazing. So yeah, as you can see, I landed 253.66 points and this is actually above the threshold of 250 points. I was only on the 2058th place in this competition, so wasn't really successful in that regard, but I was successful with the threshold. And that is actually what I explained to you in the previous videos, right? That in this league, it doesn't really matter how you perform in relation to the other players. It just matters here if your team lands the 200 five or 250 points in order to get the rewards and i did that i landed 253.66 and that's why i on this ethereum and that is really actually pretty exciting because my first game week and i'm already earning the rewards here so refresh the page right now and then already see it here in my Sora account so this is already then being credited into my uh, Sora wallet you could say so already have the points zero to ethereum here immediately and that's obviously pretty amazing first time competing and first time winning uh, which makes me pretty excited and this is it this is how you make money on Sora compete in the correct leagues compete in the leagues uh, where you see the highest chance of winning for you. For me to start out now here on the platform, it is definitely the rare All-Star League because this is the league where you would get the threshold uh, reward, right? And this is what I just uh, was able to do. I just scored over 250 points here with my team and that's why I could earn the 0 0.02 Ethereum. Just to give you a little look here already in the other game week that is still live, I think until tomorrow, but my players already played. So I can already see here that I had quite some good performances here with Bruno Martins Indy, scored uh, a 91. 
Then I had Sandra Trenstad, 52, that is uh, pretty solid as well. Alison, unfortunately, he's so consistent, but unfortunately, um, this weekend against West Ham, he scored an own goal as a goalkeeper, very unfortunate. And then Joe Mario scored 48, which is also really, really good. Uh, Porto won against Santa Clara in the Portuguese league. And unfortunately, Birga Festrete did not play. The DNP means did not play. Um, my fault, actually, my bad. I didn't check it, I didn't look it up. Um, but he actually um, had a one game ban due to um, a yellow card in the last game that he had in the Belgium league. So yeah, that's a bad management performance of myself, you could say. So uh, I would say classic beginner mistake, but I actually couldn't do anything else because those four rare cards here, Bruno Martins in the Trendstart, Joe Mario and Festrete are the only rare players I have. So I wouldn't have been able to change him anyways. And I still, I think got, yes, I, I still got 232 points and that is obviously above the threshold of 205 points. So that should earn me 0 0.01 Ethereum actually for the last game week, which is obviously as well fantastic uh, considering that I didn't even play Birger Fest, right? Like it wasn't even possible for me to gain points with him because he didn't play and I still earned the reward because my other players performed quite well. All right. Then you can see here Bruno Martins Indy actually uh, has this captain mark here. This is something you can select once you register your team. And I would suggest to pick this wisely here because the captain earns a certain bonus. You can see that here um, based on the experience level, like how many games they already played. They have a higher bonus. Um, and in my case, Bruno Martins Indy actually is the captain and therefore also earns a higher bonus. And he, for me, has been a very consistent player. I mean, at least in the two games I, I played him with right now. So I normally pick him as a captain um, and rely on his performance uh, more heavily than on the other ones. All right, I hope that was exciting for you to see how this reward system works, how it actually works to get cards on Soraya. I didn't get cards this time, but I got rewards, but it would have been possible as well if I landed on the podium score, for example, to also earn cards on top of the Ethereum reward that I earned anyways now. Uh, pretty exciting for me, it hope it's exciting for you too. And if you want to start out on Soraya as well, I can give you a little help with my affiliate link down in the description. If you click on the link in the description, it's my affiliate link and signing up through that link immediately once you clicked on it will actually get you a free card from Sorare once you collected your first five cards on the new card auction market. Plus, I will personally give you my Sorare success checklist with all the elements that I put together to set you up for maximum success. All right. Hope you're enjoying the game, have fun collecting, investing and playing and I'll see you back here next time.